hi guys welcome to my channel so today I have a haul for you as you guys know on this channel sustainability matters and we encourage imperfect sustainability so this is a snapshot of some of the pieces I'll be sharing with you today and I hope you get inspired so let's do this so this is the winter version of the pieces that my friend gave to me from her closet and this first piece is a sweater dress you guys know a sweater dress is a staple every single winter and today I'm pairing it with my green fedora hat oh you guys know my favorite color is green so I absolutely love this green and black is a great combo for me and it's often a go-to the piece is a hundred percent polyester but I am trying to keep it out of the closet so it would be the base piece for all of the looks today so the second find that I got I got it from a different friend and very special person who gave me this piece for my birthday it's the bag the bag mm -hmm. is one of my 2020 best finds and this piece was gonna be upcycled but I fell in love with it and I asked to keep it when it was offered to me so thank you so much Diane for giving me this piece I absolutely love it and I can't wait to wear it post pandemic it's definitely a post pandemic piece that you need to flaunt and hang out with the girls and just have fun during the Christmas season I styled it with a faux leather piece I'm not a huge fan of faux leather and you guys know the reason for this there's no disputing the fact that faux leather looks absolutely stunning but guys it's definitely not a great fabric and my advice is if you do have it in your closet already which i'm sure many people do definitely wear it to death it's not gonna last as long anyway and at the same time just avoid buying them in the future this to me is one of the greatest finds because it's a muff and this piece doubles as a handbag as well as a muff i'm not sure how much you guys know about muffs but muffs were introduced to women in the fashion industry in the 16th century and both men and women wore it in the 16th and 17th century and you could definitely do more research and find out but it's an absolutely stunning piece that I just love and love the versatility of it because it's a bag and it's a hand warmer. So yeah, no brainer. Number three is a unique puffer jacket and I absolutely love the style of it. I love the unique threading details of it i find it very very flattering on it's an excellent neutral piece that would go with absolutely everything in your wardrobe i love it this piece is made of nylon and other synthetic materials i often encourage others to buy these pieces second hand so to reduce the production of these materials because they are a hazard to life on earth it's too bad that so many high-end companies such as Prada are using nylon today and nylon is such a huge seller right now because of the upgraded bag that they are producing as well as their puffer coats yeah i believe some are made of recycled nylon hopefully that is correct Sorry 
to interrupt guys but just a quick note hi guys if you just so happen to just click on my video you are new please click the red subscribe button so here they are guys if you click on these buttons you'll be part of my channel and you'll be notified when i post new videos and most importantly guys it's free thank you so much for subscribing love ya let's get back to the video number four is an equally gorgeous neutral piece and this piece is a jacket that i fell in love with it on site because oh the details on this piece guys the details it's the pockets for me it's also the herring bone detail that absolutely just gives it this gorgeous rich looking texture that makes this jacket look so expensive i i just love to wear it because it pairs beautifully with other neutral pieces in my closet and i've worn it several times i've replicated it as a chanel piece because it just has the that richness and that texture that just brings luxury to a look and uh, look at this pairing i am absolutely proud of this pairing i think it's beautiful another pairing is this piece that i really really love as well <laughs> guys as i've said before neutral pieces ah uh, it just goes beautifully and elevate any cheap looking piece although this piece is as equally cheap too but you cannot tell by looking at it five i am also excited about because it's this gorgeous yellow is it yellow is it mustard i don't care it's just absolutely stunning and it's such a thick gorgeous quality piece so guys i'm just gonna style it two ways of course it's one of the most flattering styles ever it's a wrap top and for those who are hoodie fans it's a great combination of two styles that you can go incognito i am not a great um hoodie person <laughs> but this hoodie had me because it's so elegant it's so oh the construction of this piece is exceptional and the fabric is a combination of cotton as well as some elastin for comfort, which I don't know why it doesn't make sense because cotton would have been just fine. 100% cotton is fine with me, but companies do love elastin and I guess it has its place, but yeah, it was totally unnecessary here because it's a fabulous piece. Ooh, 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 yes, number six, number six. I had almost forgotten this piece. This is one of the most stunning bomber jackets I've seen in a very long time. I mean, the details on this piece it's it's absolutely gorgeous i love the zipper details which is replicated on both pockets i 
love ah the button details at the top guys this is a piece that it's a forever piece in anyone's closet it's timeless it's a hundred percent cotton it's sturdy as hell and ah uh, yeah it's a really really cute piece and just love it there is a black piece that is very similar that i've had in my closet for over 20 years now and i'm gonna compare these two pieces one day but it's a bit snug but yeah love it number seven is a typical jumper it's a gray mold sweater and it's very similar to my cardigans that I've shown you previously. I have a love-hate relationship with this piece. That's because it's 100% synthetic. <laughs> and at the same time, it's warm. But it doesn't need to be synthetic to be warm, you know. And that's the message that I often try to convey. That you could use natural fibers and they work and serve their purposes even more than synthetic items but what i love about this piece is that of course i can pair it with my broad belt and it goes beautifully and it currently matches with my braids so i love styling this piece Number eight, which is the final piece in this haul, is a piece that many of you would dismiss, but I love this piece. The reason why I love it is that, one, it's made from natural fibers, uh, a cotton knitted piece, and I love the silhouette, the shape, the style of this piece. It's like a bat wing kimono sleeve type of style so that is very flattering on everybody seriously it is and i love that you could wear it off shoulder <laughs> so that's it guys thank you so much for watching and i'll see you soon take care bye, -bye.